SM and swing arm systems ready. Roger. LC flight control. Go. Substep kilo flight controls ready. Roger. LCAB. Go. First step, uh, B, A, B, airborne, just vehicle external. Right. LCOVM. Go. Third stage power down checklist is complete. Roger. And OVM, oh. you're on external power. We're completely powered down. I'll roger that. LC locks two. Go. Second stage LO2 conditioning active. Roger. LC fuel one. Go. QBC LH2 topping and conditioning are active. Roger. LCG on one. Go. Yeah. This is ready. Roger. Happy going in.
from Delta Launch Control. We have scrubbed for tonight's attempt, uh, which was targeted to go at uh, at 3:53, but we expired our time in the window. Mick, can you can you tell us a little more? Yeah, absolutely, Josh. Uh, you know, teams worked very hard this evening, diligently getting through the launch process, uh, looking at everything that they had to to get into the terminal count this evening. Uh, as we picked up the count at T minus four and got into uh, terminal count, uh, the team received a gaseous helium reg pressure alarm. Um, that kicked them out. Uh, that was what you heard the hold, hold, hold on the countdown net was for. Um, the team is evaluating that and looking at it. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't have enough time this evening to go troubleshoot that and try again for a launch. So we're going to uh, lean forward here and uh, uh, plan for a 24-hour uh, turnaround tomorrow for a launch time of 3.31 a.m. However, that is contingent upon the uh, detanking process this evening and the team continuing their evaluation of the gaseous helium, helium reg alarm. Um, if they determine or find anything that they can't uh, get ready for tomorrow's launch attempt, the launch management team will get together and determine uh, if we uh, maintain that 24-hour turnaround or if we go to a 48-hour turnaround. So that's where we are right now. Uh, unfortunately, we did scrub this evening due to this issue, uh, but the teams will continue to work, uh, work this problem and uh, move forward to try to get Parker Solar Probe on its way to the sun. Uh, thank you, Mick, for the update. And with that update, we'll now go back to Marie Lewis. Marie. All right. Josh and Mick, thank you so much for keeping us updated. As you just heard, uh, today's launch attempt has been scrubbed, and this concludes our coverage of today's Parker Solar Probe launch attempt. For updates on the next attempt and the Parker mission, visit nasa.gov. Thank you for getting up so early with us, and we invite you to rejoin us when we try again. Have a great day.